Hey guys, Andy Robertson here with CQ8 Academy, and then today I want to shoot a really quick video to explain the difference between correlation and causation, and that concept's relationship to the CQ exam. So in the CQ exam, we're studying this thing called scatter plots or XY diagrams or XY plots, or you might call it linear regression. And in that topic, there's this really important concept called correlation versus causation. It is absolutely possible to have two variables where a change in the first variable causes a change in the second variable. And, and that relationship might be correlation, but not necessarily causation. That's an important concept. And let me use the CQE exam to highlight here what I mean. Passing the CQE exam does not cause your career to grow, okay? Those two things correlate, but they don't have a causal relationship. And what I mean is that to pass the CQE exam, you have to learn new things, you have to be able to apply the things you're learning. You essentially are becoming more knowledgeable as a quality engineer. And that, that is what causes your career to grow, not necessarily the act of passing the CQE exam. There's no causal relationship between getting your exam, exam results back and then poof, instantly being promoted. That's not how it works. It's correlation without causation. So obviously I recommend people become a CQE because it correlates with career growth, right? Deming said, it's not enough to, to do your best. You first have to know what to do and then do your best. And that's what becoming a CQE is. It's knowing what to do. And then if you apply that and you, and you work hard and you do your best, that's when you've done really well and that's when your career grows. So I wanted to make sure you understood that difference between correlation and causation and the relationship between becoming a CQE and growing your career. All right, that was it for today. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button down below so that other people just like you can find the same information. And if you really love it and you want to go on that journey to become a CQE, hit that subscribe button and the bell icon so that as I publish new, new material, you get notified and you can stay on that journey with me. All right, thanks so much. Have a good day. Bye.